taking the wait week off, we're back now with Iron Blood Orphans, and it started off with quite a bang. I mean, we get a skirmish between the, between the workers and Galahorn trying to get independence, and I thought, you know what, that's pretty good. Everyone's now screaming for independence because Cordelia's basically a ray of hope for them. And yeah, we get a lot more characters driven, like storylines, and also. I have my suspicion that Fumi's done, and she kind of did kind of betray Cordelia in the end. Sort of. I'm not too sure that it's still going to go down that route because she says, oh, someone's going to assassinate her, and why did, I, why did I disobey the orders? So I don't know whether she saved her or didn't. That's kind of a bit more ambiguous in how they're actually presenting that. So hopefully it does actually go towards something awesome. But yeah, the only problem I can see now is Cordelia's character. Like, in a sense, when she got a kiss, she turned into conventional anime girl. Like, it's not a horrendous idea because... Again, in her character arc, it sort of works because she's not she's unsure about all these things. She's not really been exposed to all this kind of thing, so she's not really known to what's going on. So in her in her regard, you can understand why she acts like this. Maybe yeah, it's not the greatest of character driven things to do because it's too conventional. But in her kind of character arc, I think it somewhat works. And I think that's the reason why I kind of was bat an eye to it when I actually kind of looked into it. I didn't really care too much about doing it because her character kind of deserves something like this because she's not she's really unsure about how, what the, how the world works so when she gets kissed by a boy she doesn't really know what to do so they're kind of exploring that idea and exploring it quite well because again she doesn't know what to do I'm not supportive of the ship I want Atara and um, Katsuki to get together but that's never going to happen but yeah I mean hopefully I don't actually divulge too much into conventional anime girl so otherwise I will get pretty pissed because I did like a character pretty, pretty much but yeah we also get to learn about Biscuit's character as well. We learn that Biscuit's character was a part of Dort 2. And basically what happens is he was poor and so his parents worked in the factories. And what happened was he has an older brother. And what happened was his, his uh, mum and dad died in an accident. Working, I guess working at the factories. And then, yeah, basically what happens is he, him, him uh, and his sisters basically go live with his grandmother. That's how we know, that's how we know of him. And he was really poor. And, and also, he actually calls his brother and says, yeah, what's up, kid? And then that's basically, I'm guessing next episode will now divulge into their backstory a bit more. And kind of have this, like, kind of back and forth between them. Hopefully, because it does look like it's pretty interesting. But yeah, I mean, as a whole, episode episode's great. The openings themselves are pretty good. I mean, I've never been a fan of opening twos in Gundams. I mean, the only one I actually liked was season twos of, of Double O's, because Double O's season two opening two was awesome. Other than that, I've never been a really big fan of opening twos in Gundam. This one actually kind of surprised me. I liked it. But yeah, I mean, hopefully the actual series continues in this regard. I can see going forward, the guy with the mask is coming back. I was like, yeah, the guy with the mask is coming back. Because he always like, appears sometimes in Gundam. But yeah, it reminds me of Gundam Wing a little bit. But yeah, all around a good episode. I liked it a lot. But... With all that said, if you want to leave a like, do leave a like, tell me quite a bit. If you want to leave a sub, do leave a sub, tell me quite a bit. With all that said, I have been a driver, and I'll see you later. Bye for now.